Family in Pennsylvania wishing they microchip one of their pigs. Huh, okay. Well, this sneaky guy got out of his pen and they've been on the hunt ever since. Looking for Porky. Take a look. The animals at the Roomba residence along Marsh Creek Road in Cumberland Township are used to a feast, but now the family is dealing with a different kind of pig out. He's hard to catch. He's not even greased. <laughs> Chelsea Roomba brought home her new porker on Friday. Kevin Bacon's former family decided he was too big to feed. They had bought him thinking he would be a small house pig. Things got off on the right hoof. <laughs> they loved Kevin. They were, they were climbing all around him. Until an unruly Kevin thought he needed six degrees of separation and made an escape into the woods. On Saturday morning, Kevin was inside his pen when he decided to kick off his Sunday shoes and cut loose. The 197 pound pig knocking out this post to get free. We got a call from the campground across the street and they said, hey, we've got your pig walking around and, and that's really what started the search. The family scoured the paths just off the property, finding Kevin's footprints along the way. They fear he could be hurt by a predator or a hunter who might mistake their pet for prey. Unfortunately, they might not know the difference between a wild pig and, and Kevin, so we don't want him to end up on someone's dinner table. Meanwhile, the Roombas have the table set for Kevin, leaving out ample food and flowers for him to nibble. They've lined the paths on the property with corn, hoping to draw him in. They've spotted their spotted friend several times, but he's keeping his snout out of the pen, preferring the life of a free-range pig. The Roombas are confident they'll corral him soon. We have all of the right things in place. We just need a smidgen of cooperation from Kevin Bacon. <laughs> a free range pig. You got to like that. I honestly, I feel like don't trap him in. If he does not want to be kept in, let him roam free. Clearly he can handle himself because the first thing I thought while watching the story, Kevin gone. But no, he showed up several times. He just has one request. Mm. Don't fence me in. <laughs> There we have it, people. <laughs> Somebody uh, said the word barbecue and he, he got scared. And he's off. See, you can't, no, don't, he's not a spare ribs kind of guy. <laughs>